Hello and welcome to today's tutorial. From quick tutorial, today I'm gonna show you how you can fix black screens, crashes, freezing, heavy lagging or error, error messages in Farming Simulator 19. And before we get into the video, I would like to ask you for a small favor. If you would like to help me to grow this channel to reach more people, to help more people, I would really, really appreciate it if you could make the time now to click on the like button leave a small comment, everything helps and I would really, really appreciate it. Thank you very much. So let's get right into it. Say um, you have a problem. The first thing you have to do is to identify the issue. Are you seeing an error message? Is the app freezing or abruptly, cl abruptly closing? Pinpointing how the app is misbehaving will help you figure out what the problem is. So if you do that, um, you already you already solved half the problem. That's often not easy to do, but uh, I can recommend you another video from our channel, which is on the top right corner right now. And if you have done that, the second step I always tell people is to check for updates. So how do you do that? I also linked you a video on the top right corner where I can show you how you can for example find updates uh, within an application or anything at all no so if you check for updates in an application or anything at all or a game or anything uh, on the top right corner right now so if you check for updates and your application is on the latest version, we can proceed to step three. If you run an application for a long time, uh, the computer, for example, can overheat or background applications can pile up. So just try to restart the application on hand. This is just an example application, what you see here. And um, for example, I could do that if you just if I just uh, click uh, on the uh, red X and uh, press close. And yeah, there are different ways to close the game. You can also go down here to the task manager, down to the uh, taskbar, press right click on the task manager, and you can see I have three apps running right now. The task manager. Uh, the, my browser and OBS Studios and you can just right click and end task or you can go down here and end task then your game or your application will instantly close and um, you can restart it yeah and why you should do this uh, as I already explained this can solve some temporary glitches and if that does not help. I want you to press the Windows key on your keyboard or go, on, go down here to the left corner and go to power with one click. And you have to restart your uh, computer uh, if you really may want to make sure that every glitch is, is gone out of your game, every temporary uh, glitch is taken care of. And um, that's the next step after restarting the application doesn't work. Just go to restart and restart your PC for once. And this also can solve a lot of problems within an application. And yeah, if you restart your game, you restart your computer, you also make sure that nothing else is running, um, <coughs> which is not, um, turned on in the startup the startup section in the task manager as i already told you you go down to the task one press right click go to task manager you can see that status of a lot of background applications uh, right clicking for example acrobat Corp uh, corporation sync on <coughs> for example right clicking on that you can disable it make sure that it doesn't auto start um, and you can make sure that this application doesn't auto start when you restart your pc 
and um, uh, if you disable all of them here, all of that, uh, those background applications, you can make sure that nothing gets in the way of a smooth uh, experience with your with the application. Yeah, yeah. And coming to point five, if your app application as a as an app cache or data, you can um, clear it. And if this doesn't work, uh, if this doesn't work you will have to go to your control panel which you can also find down in the window search and you can go to programs and you have to go to programs and you will um, click on programs uh, programs and features and look for the app i will just pick some random Overwolf, for example, you can go uninstall the app. You press yes if Windows asks you if you really want to do this. And then, I'm not going to do this right now because I have to reinstall. You're going to press yes here and you're going to download the app from the internet again. And yeah, if you reinstall the app, you have the best chance to fix the problem because maybe when you saved, something in the app uh, in the back there was a small error which uh, created um, an issue in, in the code so by reinstalling you can make sure that that's not a problem and uh, one last thing uh, you can for example right click on the app um, and go to prop properties and here you have some important details this is only ex an example application but uh, here you can see uh, if the size is uh, very big and or bigger than the application could should be and in that case you should definitely reinstall and uh, yeah you can also go down here to open file location where you can find you can find your app uh, in your Windows Explorer and yeah you can clear the cache or the data from from your app as well in here but I'm gonna show you this in another video please uh, I want to refer you to the uh, top right corner where you can see that I've linked you a video on how to update an application any application a game and um, I will also link you how to clear a cache or data on your computer and or in an application and yeah and to conclude what I already told you you should definitely go through all the steps I told you so first start by looking for updates then restart the application simply after that restart the PC you're on or your uh, phone or any other device and uh, if you did that the last resort I would go to is to reinstall the application and if this uh, if that doesn't work I can't help you really you have to um, leave a comment maybe to explain me the problem in more detail and I will make sure that you get an answer and yeah that's gonna be it um, I hope you liked the video and as I already said consider liking subscribing and leaving a comment love you bye